Back in 1994, the whole world got a major wake-up call. The fragments of a comet, Shoemaker-Levy 9, hit Jupiter. It could quite easily happen here. The question then is, are we prepared? We photograph patches of sky repeatedly. And then we look for things that move. We provide the data to calculate orbits, working out whether asteroids are actually going to be a problem. The Spaceguard UK project was started because nobody else was doing it. We started um, raising a few ripples uh, with politicians and things like that. We really thought something was going to happen. It didn't. Um, so we decided to start this place up, and if the government doesn't want to do it, we'll do it ourselves. Now, um, in here, this is where we control our remotely uh, controlled telescope outside. What we've got on the screen here are three images that we took in the early hours of this morning. There are plenty of stars on the image, but one of them isn't. So if we get the machine to stitch those together and play them back one after another, the stars are pretty much in the same place, but there's a little fella here that's moving. We now have a report ready to send to the Minor Planet Center in the United States. There's no government funding for this whatsoever. The building is run on the proceeds of the visitors. We just crack on and do what we can do. Obviously, at the beginning, um, we were viewed with a certain amount of suspicion. But since we took over as the National Near-Earth Object Information Centre, um, we have a certain amount of credibility. This is a sample of a meteorite that uh, you may well have heard of uh, in February of last year. Um, a meteorite burst over the Russian city of Chelyabinsk, a fairly small one. It was only about 17 metres across. But the shockwave from the explosion um, above the ground shattered all the windows in the city. What will happen is if we've got time, then a national agency, almost certainly NASA, will be tasked with de a deflection mission and they will be sent off to give the thing a push and push it out the way. It, it, it's terrifically good fun, but it is fairly routine now. But you do get quite a buzz when you find what you're looking for. We could quite happily move away and do absolutely nothing and still get the same level of income from pension. So for us, it's important. That's why we do it. Eventually, you know, something will come along. Very rare, it may not happen in our lifetime, but sooner or later it will, and if we're not ready for it, then down we go.